Jordan, give us, give us a rundown of your overall impression of how, how fall camp has gone. Um, the mentality that we all have and, you know, the atmosphere and how hard we're all trying, um, really that's what's, what's important right now. And our assignments and all that's going to come. But right now, we, we just really love to play, and uh, it shows out here. we got a lot of new guys here and, you know, guys that are trying to learn the system and, and do things. At the end of spring, um, everyone was on the same page, and, you know, everyone was bought into it. And now we just, we just got to get all the new people that are here and, and then, uh, you know, get them to buy into it. And then just, uh, you know, start getting our fundamentals down and, and start getting our assignments down. And once we get our assignments on all that, then everything else is going to come because the effort, the effort, it, it's, it's going to be there. So uh, we just got to pick it up these next couple weeks and, uh, and then, you know, get ready for Ole Miss. In watching you run through drills with Coach Popping, uh, his passion and excitement and enthusiasm that he brings to you guys, talk a little about how he's made you a better player and how he's made the, uh, the linebackers as a whole overall uh, a better group. Um, out here at uh, practice? Um, I think what Coach Papinga did a good job at is recognizing our weaknesses. And so when we come into our drills this, you know, this uh, fall camp, it's all about what our weaknesses were and then we work on those weaknesses. And I can already see tons of improvement from, from all the outside linebackers and including myself. Um, I feel like I'm a, a much better pass rusher than I was last year already. Here we go. Here we go. Um, and then just his enthusiasm and, and his love for the game. You know, he was a player, so we all respect him, and we understand, you know, what he did when he was here. So as, as players, we all respect him as our coach. Rob Morse came in here as a GA. He's working with Coach Weber in the offensive line. Have you had any communication with him or maybe gone to him and kind of picked his brains a little bit and say, hey, how do I become a better outside linebacker or maybe a better linebacker? Or what um, did you do this in the NFL? You know, I've talked to him a little bit, um, but it hasn't been about linebacker. It's been about special teams. So, um, you know, one thing he um, – he kind of was telling me is you know as if you want to make it to the next level special teams got to be good at special teams so and really we're getting our whole team to buy into special teams this year we're taking it very seriously and we're having fun with it and so uh, but I plan on going in once you know our schedule calms down a little bit get a little bit more time I definitely plan on going and talking to Rob and and uh, kind of picking his brain a little bit yeah overall uh, how would you characterize the defense uh, this year a lot of depth a lot of talent but overall when you take a look at the the character how would you characterize if you give a real good description of what uh, what BYU fans can expect to see on the field how would you characterize this defense oh man just passion just very passionate about the game you know last year the first the first five games we we weren't passionate we didn't have that enthusiasm this year you're gonna see it the whole year um, starting game one I guarantee it you know I don't know, you know, I can't sit here and say we're going to win all our games and we're going to do all this, but I, I will tell you one thing is we're going to come out and we're going to play with passion and we're going to have fun out there. Jordan Pendleton, starting BYU outside linebacker.